Hello everyone. I'm going to show you a slideshow. Um, I'm go over here. Go to. Oh, I have to do this one. Okay. Slideshow. All right. So I'm using the Nikon One J5. Okay. And. Uh, I've been using a, a couple of different, one was a TV, uh, OLED TV, one was uh, my uh, 3440 by 1440 monitor, and one was from my laptop, the uh, M1 MacBook Air. So these are different pictures using the, I believe the 6.7 millimeter Uh, lens uh, 6.7 to 13 millimeter 18 to 35 equivalent to full frame and what I'm showing you now is my uh, latest build computer AMD 7800X3D in the um, Y70 case um, make a long story short I'm practicing with the flash built into the camera and I'm trying the different uh, flash settings that they have. And you can see the little round thing. So when it's flash, with that round thing on the bottom is uh, the camera lens. And this is a flash right here, but I got it perfect. And I'll go back to uh, those two uh, uh, lenses but I'm still practicing with the TV so a guy was showing the picture and then I'm using the creative style this morning after I picked up my uh, camera bags and when I uh, watered the uh, the plants and trees in the front and back but look how gorgeous these pictures are Now that picture of that squirrel, I have it where I view the uh, photos immediately. And if I had that off, I would have gotten a, like three feet away from this squirrel. So I think the squirrel was bothering the uh, this pigeon who's on top of her chicks. She was protecting them. But anyway, he ran off because I spooked him. But look at the picture quality on these flowers and this is in the shade I got a closer look at the uh... and then of course I did a selfie so let's go back here to uh, close the slideshow come on all right I did that so what do you think if I go back up let's just look at one of these and I'm gonna put the plus sign on it Uh, it's not working. Okay. Let me do this. Yeah, it's still in slideshow mode. All right. So, let's bring it closer. Okay. What do you think? Isn't that a wonderful picture? It's gorgeous, isn't it? And if I put it on uh, full frame or widescreen, there we go. Isn't that gorgeous? And let me move my mouse here. I just want to center it. So I'll just keep going up. Ah, page up. Okay. So I want to show you this bird. Uh, very good mother. I don't know how long it takes for the chicks to, uh, but they're pretty big. Well, they're not that big, but anyway. 
Uh, this is a little blown out right now, but there she is. You can see here, right here when I had the mouse cursor on her. There she is. And this is the nest, okay? And if I scroll up again, the nest is right here. So these are sharp pictures. I got it on the creative style, which is the vivid type of quality pictures. And all you have to do is use your finger on the LCD screen and it'll focus and take a picture. That's how easy it is. So the reason why I like this type of method of taking pictures is when you hit the shutter button or the shutter release button, it shakes the camera. And so you get a little movement. My picture quality has been pretty good, but I found this is a lot better. So look at this. All right. And this is the squirrel. I don't know if I can increase it also. But uh, that, that's the only thing is I like viewing my pictures. But look how sharp that squirrel is, even when I magnify it this way. And imagine if I was only three feet away. So, anyway, this is how sharp the camera is. One inch sensor with the 18 to 35. And they say this is the best lens for it. That's a pretty shot, too. Yeah, there's the close up. So it's gorgeous, right? And I won't go into there. Uh, well, I will. I want to show one other thing on the computer, okay? So, this is without any flash, all right? This is where I got the flash just right. And what I did was I tilted up. Well, wait a minute. Yeah, let me know. Maybe a little bit larger. Okay. So I tilted it up, the flash. And it got me the perfect resolution. So this is with the flash. This is without a flash. So you can see it's a little bit better. And then uh, if I go in further, you can see where the flash hits the, uh, the lens hood. I had the lens hood on. I don't know why indoors, but I usually put lens hoods on just in case I drop the darn thing and it protects the glass. Okay? But that's the story on that. So you can use the flash, just tilt it up. I got it at 1 32nd, 32 thousandths of a second uh, shutter speed. Okay? On the flash. I think I have it on TTL. But just to show you, um, let's see, this one. I want to it. So I'll end this video right here. Let's see if I can make it larger. Isn't that gorgeous? Yeah, I'll do it like that. So I also want to say thank you very much. This is my 2000th video on YouTube. I want to thank you for all the members that have supported me, liked me, um, wrote comments. I do uh, read your comments. Um, they're very cordial, very knowledgeable. Um, my uh, videos are a little bit different from most people. I don't usually add music to them unless I make a mistake. <laughs> and I do plenty of them, all right? Uh, I just like trying out different stuff. I am not subsidized by YouTube or any other company. Uh, if I like a product, I'll go and buy it, okay? And I'll try it out, and then I'll give you my review on what I think. And most of the products I have, I've kept. I've given away some stuff to some friends so you know either a computer or um, cameras or lenses you know uh, I look at it, the individual needs something 
uh, I help them out. So thank you again uh, for my 2000th video. I hope to do more. And uh, remember, stay safe, keep smiling, and I'll see you next time. Goodbye, folks. Have a wonderful day. And then I have to move my mouse all the way over here to go to the closing scene. Bye, folks.